The global zero emission heavy duty vehicle segment, including battery electric and hydrogen fuel cell vehicles, is already, today, helping power a dynamic and growing transport sector. Efficient, productive, and powerful zero emission vehicles are quietly and cleanly collecting refuse, doing home deliveries, and running freight, all while making the air we breathe cleaner and reducing noise pollution. Fleets are setting ambitious goals, increasingly confident the hundreds of zero emission models available around the world can meet their needs now. Building on progress in buses and vans, manufacturers are expanding their offerings with a staggering growth in products coming to market. But we must move faster. What will it take to accelerate zero emission truck adoption? to transform the biggest polluters on the road into tools critical to achieving global net zero emissions by 2050. What will it take to secure net zero, to limit warming to no more than 1.5 degrees? It takes working together to accelerate climate action. Leading nations from around the globe are now on a pathway to zero emission transport, signaling a turning point. Their goal, our goal, to reach 30% zero emission truck and bus sales by 2030 and 100% zero emission sales and manufacturing by 2040. Recognizing the alarming trajectory of climate pollution from on-road freight, nations today are committing to bring transport emissions in line with Paris Agreement ambitions via a global agreement on zero emission trucks and buses. A new memorandum of understanding across nations and supported by sub-national governments, manufacturers, and fleets. This agreement will help put the world on the path to achieve net zero emissions by 2050. Together, we will slash climate emissions from road freight, deliver cleaner air to the communities most in need, invest locally and drive innovative financing tools, create good paying jobs with a strong future, and improve energy security in adopting nations. This is a global effort, backed by both government and the private sector. The transition to zero emission road freight will be felt worldwide, benefiting communities and countries as they move toward a more sustainable world. We can't wait. The time has come to drive to zero.